everybody Never sure. I, I'm. 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 So, I'm sorry. I should say that better. I'm not sure that anybody's ever said those specific words to me, Neil. In my days of living. But it's awfully nice of you to say. How are you, Neil? Hey. Lovely to see everybody. Welcome to the Amplify this December daily, 31 days, constant streaming, continually asking the question, have you had enough of me yet? So many interesting things happen when one, uh, when one engages this way, including like, you know, trying to expand into something new and use your rig in some new way. That, that that completely, you know, taxes your computer past what it can handle. Today I had an interesting uh, interesting thing happen where where I where I had this had this this wonderful thing set up. I mean I, I don't know if you're interested in this or not, but I'm I'm gonna offer it to you as if you were. 
This is Ableton Live, if any of you don't know it. I think most of you who hang out with me do know it. Uh, in any case, there's this great synthesizer in it called Wavetable. And you'll notice up in the right-hand side, there's a, there's a, a central processing unit percentage indicator. It's how much weight I put on my processor. So this morning I was playing with this synthesizer. It was a really nice arpeggiated thing. Let me uh, see if I can just turn it on here for you for a minute. You hear what that does? It just completely, completely takes me out of the realm of any possibility. There really wasn't much to ask, I didn't think. I'm not doing doing too much, but, but, uh, but the fact is that whenever you run visuals and audio on a Mac laptop, this is what we call uh, dead in the water. So, anyway, oh my. Let's take a look at this chat. We're missing folks. Mr. Kowalski, hi again from Scotland. Great catching you this week. Oh, it's a pleasure to have you. Very, very much a pleasure to have you. Um, and let's see who else is here. Raymond is here. Yes, I'm, I'm, I'm not exactly sure uh, if anybody else has, 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 um, so, you know, uh, been here more than you, Raymond. You've been here kind of since since the beginning. So, uh, so uh, kudos to you. Um, oh man. So uh, David Schneerman is here. I see David just telling me some news that I did not know, which is that uh, Leslie West. There we go. Leslie West passed away today. Front man of the of Mountain, right? I, I actually do not know their work very much. My bad. So let's see. Uh, Neil thinks that I have a beautiful rack. I don't even know what to say except thank you. Um, Bill Sussman is here. Hey. Hey, Bill. There you go. Bill is here. Raymond is here. Yeah, Raymond. Whenever, whenever. In fact, this is this is true, kind of for everything. Once you've missed chat for a, to a certain degree, it doesn't fill in behind you. It only fills in in front of you, as you as you go on. Yes, and there is a lag for all of you uh, joining us from from Facebook, from uh, from uh, from any place else. Uh, Facebook, twenty five second lag twitch very very little lag if you're hanging out on twitch yesterday we had some audio problems on twitch i went to um to i, I actually went to uh approach the people at, at restream i don't know how how many of you know a lot about streaming or have done any streaming yourself I really don't know, so I'm 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 basically going to uh, to um, I'm I'm basically going to tell you what's going on. Uh, so so we make these streams and we do it in real time, and then it go we go out to uh, to a company called Restream.io. It's funny Restream.input output, and uh, and they send it to Twitch, YouTube, Facebook. It's all it's all good. They are really, really awesome folks. Well, I, I reached out to them about our problem on Twitch with audio yesterday, and although they couldn't help because I think it's probably a Twitch issue, there was no problem on Facebook and YouTube, and they went and they looked at every single place where I streamed to see what the problem was, and in the end, they, they couldn't solve the problem, but the customer service was so incredibly good at 10.30 at night last night, at least here on the East Coast. That means it was... 12:30 or 1:30 in the afternoon where Flora Wong is who who wishes us happy early Christmas Eve to all us folks who are living in the past and we really are because over there in uh, Brisbane it's already Christmas Eve that's kind of kind of wonderful so hey anyway David yes you are right I should know mountain and I'm kind of uh, kind of now a little bit embarrassed that I had to go look them up 
Uh, Rachel Rosencrantz is here. Thank you for coming back, Rachel. Really lovely to have you. Uh, let's see who else is here. Dan Kenny is here. Hey, Dan. Returning again. Thank you so much for joining us. Made a track last night. Um, from from what I did in the did in the um, stream yesterday, I just kind of left my synthesizer up and um, and 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 went and went and just kind of made some music last night at ten o'clock at night. Haven't done that in a while. So anyway, I have that track. Um, if you'd like to have it, you let me know, and I will uh, I will put it up on SoundCloud and I'll send you a private link to it. You let me know. Um, let's see. Raymond quotes a Jethro Tull thing. Haven't I? I don't know how how Ian is doing. I wish I did. Um, Dan, you would like it. Okay, great. Isabel, if you could make a note to that, and I will send I will send Dan a link. How about that? Great, we got 20 people on stream today. If you're there on stream and you haven't had said hi yet, please say hi, let us know you're here. It would be lovely to know that you're here. Lovely to know who's who's joining us. And if you have any burning topics for the panel, please um, please put them out in the chat because uh, I would love to talk about whatever you would love to talk about. Because uh, the only things that I seem to have to talk about are about expansion and about uh, about getting bigger. And d d does that interest anybody? You know, you'll see. Have you noticed? Let me know in the, in the chat. Have you noticed that you see a lot more of your friends all of a sudden going live on Facebook and Instagram? Have you noticed that all of a sudden people are like showing up and making music or talking or or even making interview uh, channels for themselves? Have you noticed that? This is, yeah, you're right, Raymond. This is day, this is day 23 out of 31. Feeling better with my fiddle in my hands today for some reason. <laughs> David Schneerman. Yeah, it's kind of kind of interesting. I I I, I noticed that that everybody's online all of a sudden, streaming. It's kind of wonderful. Everybody's stepping out. I used to think that it was it was because of uh, Big Brother. Oh, Flora, I have no idea what you're talking about. Would you please, if you've got a link for that, put it in for all of our guests here and for me, because <laughs> I'd love to see that. So I was really super, uh, super lucky to, uh, to be adopted by Isabel's family. Part of Isabel's family are this this couple named Ben and Jenny. They are wonderful. They have uh, they have a number of sons. Uh, one of whom is a, a great artist. Anyway, we join them for Christmas nearly every year. And uh, Ben is Swedish, and he cooks Swedish. So we have all this incredible, grand, beautiful Swedish food every Christmas. We 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 have a Swedish Christmas, and my cat is totally clawing into my leg and using me as a scratching post right now. Ouch. Um, anyway, Ben and Jenny, they cook for the whole family every year. And we, of course, we can't do that this year. That's just not happening. So guess who drove all the way to us today to drop us off cookies and some of the baked goods that Ben makes every year. They come from Saratoga Springs and they came all the way just to drive by to do a drive-by visit 
and to say hi. So we stood outside on this beautiful day up here, and uh, and and took in these this this couple of bags of 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 wonderful gifts. So we have some big old gratefulness for our family. Yeah, pickled herring's always there, Raymond. Not my favorite. Thank you for the link, Flora. It's in the chat on the Facebook side. You can come visit us on uh, Facebook and find Flora's New York Times link with Priya and Sophia and their partners making incredible gingerbread houses, including a Frank Lloyd house. It's unbelievable. And David Schneerman, I can uh, guarantee you I'll be going to Mountain right away and I'll be getting familiar at the, with this complete hole in my musical education. And I'll let you know all about it tomorrow. Of course, in solidarity with Leslie West and family. No way, Dan. No, you are not telling me this. Oh my goodness. The great, great guitar, guitarist. The great guitarist, Adrian Ballou, who our friend Andre Chumley, who is who often appears on uh, on our stream here and, uh, and also has his own Meatless Mondays stream, talks about politics all the time. We have a, we have a great time together. Andre takes care of Adrian Ballou on uh, on tour. I had no idea that he was 71. That is incredible. Oh man. Stay stay tuned. I will bet you that Andre and I have some sort of Christmas Christmas interview podcast or something. With all this political meandering that's going on. delay and reverb. I was talking with my uh, buddy Adam Cuthbert, who has the label Slash Sound. If you like uh, beautiful ambient uh, and uh, electronic music, you, you, you would love Slash Sound. Go, go find him on Bandcamp anywhere. Anyway, we were, we were talking today. It's funny, you know, one day... Folks are folks are people who um, who you're teaching, and the next day they're teaching you. Adam has a lot to teach me about modular synthesis, so really lovely to talk with him today. Anyway, yes. Yeah, so Adrian Ballou is 71, and Andre's not here. Thanks for the shirt. Compliments, Raymond. David Schneerman says that he can't wait to hear my version of Mississippi Queen. Uh oh.
Trevor New is here for the third day in a row. Trevor, fantastic. He's over on YouTube with us, where his channel lives. Can you guys see my cat? My uh, cat with a death wish. You'd think a guy could find a little uh, Christmas music on a stream, wouldn't you? Not here. However, did you know that I on on, on my record on um, on my record called Outerboro? Isabel will put a link directly to this tune if you would like to hear it. If you enjoy Christmas music, there's kind of a Christmas tune on my record, believe it or not. It's called I See Sleeves of Green. If I can get it together, I'll play it on Christmas Day. If I can get it together to pull that file up, then I'll play that tune for you in total on Christmas Day because that would be so much fun to do that. But for tomorrow, I'm not sure what what's going to be tomorrow. Hey, Mike Crane, so lovely to see you here. Thanks, Mike. Are any of you guys thinking of maybe starting your own thing as a result of seeing this every day? I'm 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 kind of hoping that. Uh, Somebody might uh, catch catch some desire. Just in case you are you are thinking of it at all in any way. Uh, in in terms of you know kind of like upping your virtual presence, thinking about going live. You know anything uh, which has to do with kind of being being more fully expressed online or making content. I had somebody tell me today that they were very interested in me doing a class on making content. Um, of course, that's something that I need to be doing more of. So maybe it's kind of uh, time to start thinking about that. Right, right now, I really love supporting people and teaching people about how to stream because I think that's kind of this, this, this way of reaching out and connecting with people immediately. And I love it. I love the idea that we can be more fully ourselves and take risks and kind of step out into the world being fully ourselves just online and connect with others. This, this lights my fire. Michael says both yes, but I'm light years away and laughing out loud. I'm just not exactly sure at what 
he is laughing yet. But maybe you'll tell me, Mike. Sadly, you're 25 seconds away from me, round trip. everybody. Well, listen, I've been hanging out here for a little bit. Anybody else, uh, anybody else here who hasn't said hi yet, please say hi. Let us know what you want for Christmas because I actually have a, have a direct line to Santa Claus. Uh, actually, you, you wouldn't, you wouldn't believe this, but it's not Santa Claus who makes all the decisions. It's Mrs. Claus that makes all the decisions. So, uh, so really what you want to have is a direct line to Mrs. Claus, and that's kind of what I have. Um, so if there's anything in particular that, uh, that you would like or your kids would like, please just type it in the chat, and, um, and I'll make a call. Uh, can't promise anything, of course. You know, who can promise anything these days? Anyone who wants a vaccine, all good. You got one. In fact, you're gonna get a few. It's not gonna do much for you until you have two doses. And even then, it's gonna be a while. But uh, seriously, if you need something, let me know. Yeah. I think I'm going to go now and wrap presents, make my calls. Much love to you all. Oh, there, finally, finally I got a request that I can handle from Dan Kinney. An old school analog reverb tank. Nice. Trying to think about how I could best send you an impulse response, Dan. Raymond puts a link into the chat. Some good friends of his. Anybody interested in that can go can go check out that that link. Sorry for the cheesy synth today. I'm just playing, learning more and more about control voltage. If that word is a mystery to you, ask me, I'll tell you. And someday I'll tell you all about my religious thought, which comes from my past and encompasses all religions for all holidays and kind of makes it make perfect sense. But I'm just going to mention that in passing and someday we'll talk about it. <laughs> yeah, Raymond, that's what it's like. Hey, Flora, thank you so much for the kind words. Please give my love to Luke and to everybody down there. Love you all so very much.
Be well. Tomorrow's Christmas Eve. Don't know what you got in mind. Hey, Charlie Tow Cars, I just saw you there. Thanks for stopping by. Stay well till I see you next. Come before. I mean, come tomorrow if you can. And we'll see you then.